Hello! Today on the What If Brigade, we have an unboxing video. Today is my Amazon Prime Day uh, unboxing. It's a couple days after uh, Amazon Prime Day, and I received my video. Uh, I used my super high-tech editing equipment to take off my shipping label, but I left this one, uh, this one right here, because uh, it implies that there's something flammable inside. You know, I always love ordering things on Amazon because I really get to experience the thrill of buying things twice. Once when I put in the order, and then I forget what I ordered, and then it arrives, and it, it's kind of like a surprise. Uh, so uh, I don't remember ordering anything that would be flammable, so we'll, we'll just have to see what's in there. Uh, maybe it's the wrong thing. So uh, <clears throat> always, always use uh, the right tool uh, for uh, unboxing. Make sure that you are uh, safe. And, uh, and use something that's appropriate for the job. Um, see what we got. Um, smallest first. This is a tile. Um, this, I, I have one of these uh, on my electric bike uh, right now, but it is really good for uh, remembering uh, where you left your keys because you don't have a little tracker app on it. So um, that is a lot of fun. These are my favorite gloves. Um, they're winter gloves, and uh, you, know, you might say, well, you know, if, you're, if they're your favorite gloves, you know, why do they wear, wear all, all the time? But they cost uh, $7, um, so, um, you know, they're a tech glove, so you can kind of cut your cell phone uh, through the glove, and uh, uh, I really like them. They're a little knit glove. Um, they... they uh, they're very, uh, they're, they're very nice, but they are, you know, just seven dollars. So I end up getting a new pair every year because they wear out. And then next, oh, this must be, this must be what, what, this must be what the the fancy warning light saying. So this is the X5 wireless remote control turning laser light. And uh, my light for the back of my bike. Um, it, it keeps breaking. I, I got one that I really like. It had little lights that go back and forth like Knight Rider, and I really love it. Um, but, uh, but the back, the rear lights keep breaking. The front lights are fine, uh, but the rear lights keep breaking. So I got a rear light, and it's got, it's got a little control up here, uh, wireless for making turn signals. Um, and, uh, and it's got a nice, uh, rear light. But uh, I have, of course, built-in lights on my electric bike. Uh, but this is a supplementary light. Uh, I really find that, um, you know, of course, if the electric bike runs out of batteries, I want to have a light that works even if the battery is not functioning. Um, and, uh, you know, I really find uh, that uh, um, with cargo and things like that, it's good to have uh, lights at different heights. Um, so um, my, uh, my battery-powered lights are taller than the bike-mounted lights, which are more in line with the wheels. Uh, but um, yeah, I was really interested in that. I, I had no idea that its battery was big enough to qualify as something flammable, but but that is fun. And then uh, the last thing that I think that I got in here is something that I'm very excited about uh, for my channel. And this is a knife sharpening stone set. And it has a variety of stuff in here. It has a 400 stone, 400 slash 100, 1,000 stone, a 3,000 slash 8,000 stone, um, a flattening stone, a leather strop, angle guide, and a fixed stone. Um, and uh, I actually have a bunch of dull knives in my house, uh, so this is a practical purpose <laughs> a little bit. Uh, and I have a, a knife collection, so, um, you know, I, I haven't had a sharpening kit for a while, uh, so this will help with that. And I saw on the internet it was possible sharpen a sword with one of these and I don't know if 
I'm good enough to do that, but I have some um, some cheaper swords that I'm willing to give it a try with. Uh, not going to give it a try with my uh, uh, Wakazashi anytime soon, but uh, but you know some of the more machete style uh, blades that I have. Why not give it a try? So um, this is my Amazon Prime Day unboxing video. Uh, what about you? Uh, is there anything that you ordered on Prime Day uh, that, uh, that you were really excited about? Uh, put your response down in the comments below and have a great day.